In this video, I'm going to show you how you can add CSS to a specific page inside WordPress. This can be very helpful when you need to target a certain section or a widget or anything like that, but only on a specific page. Now, adding the CSS code is very easy. It's one line of code. Isn't, this isn't going to require any sort of plugins or any JavaScript or anything like that. It's one little line of code and you can target any CSS class on any page. Let's get started. In this example, I'm going to show you how we can change the background color of the header only on the home page using this technique. This website's built using Elementor, so this whole top section is a header. So I'm going to go in here and assign a CSS class to the whole header. So this can work for any theme or page builder you're using. It's just a different way to do it. And this is just using Elementor. So this whole section, um, I'm going to click advanced and assign a CSS class to it. I'm just going to call it header BG. So now that whole top section in the header is called header BG for the CSS class. The next step we need to do is grab the page ID number. This is going to be how you target your specific page. And to do that, it's very simple. You just go to your website and the page that you would like um, to have this CSS class. If you click right here where it just says edit page or if you're just using Gutenberg or anything, it's going to be the same thing. Um, so this in the URL right here, I have it highlighted. This is your page ID. So copy this into your notepad. We're going to use this in the next step. And every page has a unique ID. So this is going to be different for uh, every page that's assigned to your website. The next step is to add the custom CSS to your whole website. Now there's a lot of different ways that you can do this, but in this example, I'm just going to use the uh, default way to add custom CSS to your website. So I'm going to go into appearance and under customize and under additional CSS, I'm going to add the following code. So this is the code that is going to make everything work. It's a CSS class called page ID. And this is that number that you just copied that's targeted to the page that you're trying to uh, add the CSS class. And then this is the CSS class that we added to the header right here on the home page. And I just did the example of a background color of like a dark gray. Now we can test it to make sure that everything is working correctly. And in this example, I only added that custom CSS to the home page. So now if I start jumping around to any other pages on the website, it goes back to the default white color. So if I go back to the home page, it should be gray. And there you go. That's how you can test it, make sure it works. Um, like I said, this is mainly useful for adding this type of functionality to headers and footers because those are a global setting. And so it's really hard to target just a certain page um, using any other technique. If you found this video helpful, make sure you give it a thumbs up, subscribe to this YouTube channel and hit the bell to receive notifications when I release future videos.